G'day, Matt Hogan here. Um, I've just finished the Fitter After 40 campaign by Robbo. Um, I did it because some mates of mine had started saying that I was starting to put on weight, uh, and I knew it. Uh, I was sitting at a desk a lot more, working hard, and I found it harder to sort of get outdoors and, and to get active, and uh, I just needed that little extra motivation. And by doing the Fitter After 40 campaign with Robbo, um, it gave me that impetus to get into it. Um, when I took my first measurements, I was a bit shocked. I was sort of 17% body fat, which was the most I'd ever been. I was 82 kilos. Um, and by doing the Fitter After 40 campaign, it was only 20 minutes some nights, you know, even, even 12 minutes just to do the Tabata. Um, and I was wondering, well, how's this doing anything? But by, by sticking to a sort of a diet and um, by, by getting into it, by the end of it, I was down to 78 kilos and I dropped to 11% body fat. So I was, I was really happy with the results and I've now got that platform to build on and to continue going on and, um, and, and living an active lifestyle. Doing the biological age test was a bit of an eye-opener for me. Um, when Robbo did all the tests and, and I came out with a 40 and a half year biological age compared to my natural age of, of 38. It was a bit of a shock because I always thought of myself as being relatively fit compared to most guys my age. So it was really good for me to, after just 30 days of a little bit of discipline and hard work coming out with a, a new biological age of 32, I felt really proud of myself for doing that. It was really important for me to do this for myself because I uh, was starting to come up with a, a lot of excuses why it was too hard for me to do it. And, and I knew that that wasn't really true. I just needed a little bit of extra motivation um, and, and having someone to sort of push you, was, I found a, a great help. And for me to realize that, that um, you know, if you want something bad enough, then, then you'll just do it.